Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome to the God Please Clean My Room Project's Daily Wash number 95. Today's topic is Instrument of Praise. Our scripture reference will be taken from 2 Chronicles, the 5th chapter, the 13th through the 14th verses, which reads, Indeed it came to pass, when the trumpeters and singers were as one, to make one sound, to be heard in praising and thanking the Lord. And when they lifted up their voice with the trumpets and cymbals and instruments of music, and praised the Lord, saying, For he is good, for his mercy endures forever, that the house, the house of the Lord, was filled with the cloud, so that the priests could not continue ministering because of the cloud. For the glory of the Lord filled the house of God. Amen. Instrument of praise. Oh my God. So today, this message is here to ask the question, are you an instrument of praise? If you're not an instrument of praise, I would like for you to take a moment to pause and think, what are you an instrument of? I assure you that you are an instrument of something. And the Lord will for us to be instruments of praise on this earth. It is not that you might be influenced by people who don't know God, but it is that you might influence them. Oh, how great wouldn't it be if we could go into our houses of worship and be on one accord, so much until a cloud would fill the space that was full of the glory of God. How awesome would that experience be? And there are some who've experienced it. So today I ask you, are you an instrument of praise? If you haven't been, there's no need for you to feel remorse. What there is a need for is change. There is a need for you to acknowledge that a change must take place so that you can move forward and do the things that the Lord desires for you to do on this earth. And remember that we were created to exalt Him, to praise Him. Everything that we should be doing should be lifting Him higher so that others might come to know Him. So go ahead and remember today, wherever you are in your workplace, wherever you are in your recreational activities, that you should be an instrument of praise. And that should never be doubted by anyone who knows you, who sees you. So just keep that in remembrance. Let's go to the Lord in prayer. Dear Lord, Heavenly Father, thank you so much for reminding us that we are, in fact, to be instruments of praise, Lord. We pray that your Holy Spirit will continue to cover us, Lord. We pray that we will all become on one accord so that your cloud might be present, Father God. We pray, Father God, that you will continue to manifest your glory in this 